blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are in the conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. We have already started here. So this is round two between these two sides who have already met once this season. And helps available out wide. Mifri's had a good look and given a corner. Bruno Fernandes tries running with the ball at his feet. Out towards the flank. Greenwood showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And the counter is on. All Brighton. Well, they would seem to be trying to expose the centre of that defence to, to runners. It makes for some terrific movement. It does, and they may be hit on the break because obviously it requires numbers forward to, to stretch them out. And he's cut it out. Manchester United were imperious when the two sides last met, and the fans are asking for more of the same. Shaw, and it's Rashford. Midway through the first half, and there's... An... He's had a shot! Goal! Manchester United! Manchester United are so well-practiced in the art of keeping the ball through, wonderful passing and movement, and a real appetite to ensure it's reflected in their goal count. Manchester United take the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Well, Brighton looking to get on the end of this. There's been quite a few crosses coming in from that left-hand side. No doubt this is an area they've identified as a potential weakness in their opposition. Well, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Chance to shoot! That's a foul, it could be a penalty. And that is a huge moment in the context of the game. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Time for a cool head, and that is precisely what he showed. Oh, you can always see he was confident about that. He always looked like he was going to score.
that has certainly made things interesting. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Sure. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Now it's all Brighton. He's got away. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Now it's all Brighton. All Brighton. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. Pulls loose, who's getting there? Madison sticks in a foot to win it back. Uh, it's a fine challenge and it goes his way. One Bissaka. Forward it goes. Brings it forward. Perez. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Over to the left. Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Probably be looking to play it square from here. So who is the target now? He's having a look at what's available. No messing about, just bludgeoned the way. Rashford. Greenwood with a shot! And he's done it! Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due. And it was a brilliant setup and finish. Manchester United get themselves into the lead. Soyuncu plays it forward. It's a loose ball. Madison. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. A real chance to break. Cristiano Ronaldo. And the first half is done. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for... Greenwood! He's done very well to get to that. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. So here comes a substitution. Tries a shot! Appearance and very necessary. Bruno Fernandes. And he's straight offside.
Kasper Schmeichel gets it upfield. And it's played forward. And it's got through. Good take, and he's had a look. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Madison already, of course, on the score sheet. The corner it is, then. And it's been taken short. He's going after it. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frightened the people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just Shaw has got himself a free kick. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. And it's Shaw. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, great ball! It's Cristiano Ronaldo! A real chance and a real let-off. He trapped it expertly, Peter, and released it very differently. Madison created that super goal to produce a lead in their last game. Gets the better of his man. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. And Didi battles to win it back. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Uh, it was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. It's come loose. Hoists it forward. Tielemans. Maguire gets it back. Baran goes looking. Greenwood. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes. Has a hit! Just about up to 75 minutes. That intervention was very necessary. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Juan Bissaka tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Goes for goal! He scored! Two up now, and they are cruising. Speed of thought, efficiency of movement, and certainty of outcome. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't need, and they paid the price and deserved to. We have got changes here, from both sides, in fact. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. He's got options out wide. That could spell trouble. It's a goal kick. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Juan Bissaka drives it forward. Martial. 
He's in! Rashford has a lot to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. They get a throw in. Martial. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Greenwood! Greenwood! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. A buccaneering run from the defender. Now a chance to break. Out to the left it goes. Cristiano Ronaldo gets wrestled off the ball. Keeper sends it forward. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Good challenge, he just stood firm. So that's it, it is all over. Manchester United always looked the more driven side, probably the better side.